Audio Imperia has some top quality libraries with great prices. For example, Nucleus is possibly the best all-round orchestral package you can get for the price, and Array of Light is the best $100 string library money can buy. However, the overlapping content, plus the light editions of Nucleus and Array, can make buying these products and figuring out cross grades from one library to another utterly confusing. Audio Imperia doesn't include info on their product pages as to exactly what content overlaps and what kind of cross grade is available, which is very frustrating. I'm going to cut through the crap cake here. If you've purchased Jaeger, then you've bought the Sustains, Tremolos, Spiccato Slow, Staccatos, Portados, Colenos, and Bartok Pizzicatos for the violins, violas, celli, and basses from Araya, as well as the legato for violins, violas, and celli from Araya, and vice versa. In turn, you've bought the Sustains, Tremolos, and Spiccato Slow for the violins, violas, celli, and basses from Nucleus, as well as the legato for violins and celli from Nucleus, and vice versa. You also bought the legato, sustains, and staccatissimos for the six horn section and the three trumpet section from Nucleus, and vice versa, as well as the sustains and staccatissimos for the four trombone section and two tubin section from Nucleus, and vice versa. You've also bought the sustains and staccatissimos for the 12 horn section and low brass section from Talos, and vice versa, while you've bought the sustains and staccatissimos for the low brass section from Nucleus, and vice versa. You've also bought the hits and rolls for the Grand Casas, Tom's High, Tom's Low, Snares High, Snares Low, Piati Hits, and Tam Tam Hits from Nucleus, and vice versa. If you've purchased Nucleus, then you've also bought the drum kit from Cerberus, and vice versa. If you've purchased Nucleus Light, then you've just bought the Sustains and Spiccato Slow for the full string ensemble patch from both Jaeger and Araya, and vice versa. You've also bought the Sustains and Staccatissimos for the full brass ensemble patch from Jaeger, and vice versa. You've also bought the Grand Casa Hits, Snare Hits, Piatti Hits, and Tam Tam Hits from Jaeger, and vice versa. The Light Library only has the classic and modern mic mixes. If you've purchased Araya Light, you've bought the Sustains, Tremolos, Spiccato Slow and Staccatos from Jaeger, and vice versa, while you've also purchased the Sustains, Tremolos, Spiccato Slow and Pizzicatos from Nucleus, and vice versa, as well as the Legatos for Violins, Violas and Celli from Jaeger, and the Legatos for Violins and Celli from Nucleus, and vice versa. The Light Library only has the classic and modern mic mixes. In turn, you've also bought the Sustains and Spiccato Slow for the full string ensemble patch for Nucleus Light, and vice versa. If you're confused, you should be. Use this video as a guide whenever purchasing any of these libraries and be sure to ask Audio Imperia about a cross-grade price if you find any of your existing Audio Imperia libraries will overlap with a potential purchase. Audio Imperia really needs to have a clearly stated instrument overlap sheet on their product pages because as it is, customers can potentially buy two or three libraries not even realising the overlap content and end up paying more than they should have for a product. I don't think it's good that Audio Imperia essentially lets you rip yourself off if you're not careful. For example, I have Jaeger, Nucleus Light and Array Light, and not once did I think to ask for a cross-grade price. So too bad for me. Use your head in this case. And that's that. I'll see you next time with some more libraries. Check you later.